Hey y'all, today is August 11th. I am 32 weeks and two days. I am extremely tired. Like, tired. Um, I was in church today and I, towards the end of the message, I was just like, I was going like, Lord, please don't think that, <laughs> that I um, weren't trying to hear the message. But it's like, I could not keep my eyes open. I'm exhausted. Like today's Sunday and Friday, I would have so much plans to do so many things and you know, I couldn't do them. Like I was, I just, I'm just tired. Let me see, okay. So I have to do an EKG because I did let the OB go. I let the midwives know at my OB office that for like the past probably two or three months, my chest probably got tight like four times. And she said, she didn't like the sound of that. And she asked me, what, what am I doing when it happens? And I'm always telling her like, I'm laying down. Um, it's just like at night when I'm laying down. So she was like, okay, she doesn't like the sound of that. She's gonna write up a script for me to go get an EKG. So I went to my, um, primary doctor and they did the EKG they said everything's fine my primary doctor did say that it's probably the weight gain um that's putting too much pressure on my chest and I'm like okay that makes sense um the people think I'm playing when I can tell them when I get to like 150 my ankle just hurt and they thought I was playing so for me to be probably 180 or almost 180 I'm not surprised but they said everything's good she told me like if it happens again just sit up and um like go forward and it should help because I was telling her like I just try to breathe through it she was like yeah try to sit up if it gets worse where she I cannot manage it and it's not like bearable then she's gonna have to let me see a cardiologist before her physical I'm hot y'all I'm hot all the time like i i will never have a baby or no, i'm sorry not never have a baby i will never be pregnant again in the summer so no this is one thing i'm not doing like i'm, I'm burning up that all the time so i'm short of breath and i can't do it i can't do it um and because i'm so tired i'm glad i listen to myself and as we got things for barry i um i would like try to pack them away and try to clean them up try to wash stuff. like i just washed a lot of stuff like i washed them in both so it's like i wash and i put away so let me see if i can show y'all like she has her stuff right here this is mainly like what she'll be wearing in her first week and then some stuff right here um yeah her little nook is coming along she got her little diaper caddy and everything but um yeah had i waited to do all that stuff pop tags and do all that crazy stuff i think i i would have been exhausted like i wouldn't be able to do it she would have just came and we wouldn't be ready for her but um yeah so i've been packing everything away putting her stuff away um and you put up her her car seat or whatever he put it up he was gonna do her um we got the baby little the little um eight in one convertible crib size out of bassinet goes mini crib mini crib then crib then toddler bed and, and then it can be like a big kid bed we have that thank god like uh we put it on the registry i wasn't going to because i thought it was expensive and then i saw that amazon was doing contributions so on the registry it's anything over a hundred dollars you can do a contribution for it and anybody can just add to it and people did i'm glad i listened to someone who said girl put everything on there so we did that um so he was gonna do that but he left he, he didn't have time before he went on his uh, trip so i guess he'll do it maybe this weekend coming up i don't know but we definitely want to have that up and then i need to get a mattress for it i think i experienced braxton hicks friday night oh my gosh and i go that thing is braxton hicks because it was so tight like every time i was using bathroom and when i was sitting it was like i could not take the pain like i couldn't take it um and then I, like whenever i would stand up the pressure would be gone if i sit down it's back there again so i know i did research that braxton hicks like you can tell it's braxton hicks if you switch positions and you don't feel it anymore so i was like okay that's probably what that was and wow i wow i bought maternity tights y'all and i had bought pants and i swore my eyes saw extra large my things were so small i was like i thought it was extra large it wasn't so i returned them and now i'm currently planning for the baby shower I'm not excited. Well, I'm excited, but I'm not excited because I'm so tired. Like, I'm exhausted, y'all. I think I had swollen feet. It was really bad, but I really think it went down. Uh, unless I got used to it, but I think it went down. I think that's a regular. But I think that's all I got for 32 weeks. I'm just ready for baby girl to come. I'm tired. I'm so tired. And I'm uncomfortable and I'm big. Oh, I can't stop. There are times when I can't even stand for long. Like, the pressure on my back is crazy. And then there's days when I'm okay. But I'm about to go take this little nappy nap because I think I'm coloring skin right now. And I'm exhausted. I'm so tired. So.